Oh, you... Uh, this is so... Uh. Dad, why are you getting cranky? I'm not cranky. I'm trying to work on my laptop, but it appears someone's been loading games onto it and taking up memory. Well, it wasn't me. It was Sam. I know who it is, Sarah. I just don't know why he doesn't store his games and his music and his videos remotely instead of putting them on my machine. Can he do that? Yeah. Well, he could if he used cloud computing. <laughs> What's so funny? A cow is funny. A cow can't be on a computer because it's got hooves. Is her name Daisy? Daisy's a good name for a cow. No, not cow computing. Cloud computing. Like up in the sky. Like the internet. So, if Sam can put his stuff up in the clouds, it would stop filling your computer up. Yes, and then my computer would run better. It's what we do at work. You play games at work? No, we use cloud computing. It means that we're only paying for programs and computer functions as we need them. It means less IT equipment at work, and that means we don't have our IT people running around trying to put out fires all over the place. Fires? It's just an expression, Sarah. What it means is our IT people can concentrate on things that will help our business to grow bigger and better. And I bet it saves money too. How did you know? You love saving money, Dad. Well, as a matter of fact, young lady, using cloud computing does save money. It can increase productivity by up to 50%, it can reduce IT support costs by up to 40%, and can save time by up to 30% during the software development cycle. And because it's off-site, we use less power and need less floor space. So you save heat? Yes, we do, Sarah. But what's even better is that we don't have to invest in technology that we only use at special times. Like my birthday and Christmas? Well, I was thinking more along the lines of the end of the financial year. Or, say, when hospitals have to cope with an epidemic. Or when all the schools send in their exam results at the one time. Oh, they're not special times. Not special like Christmas. No, but they're special in a different kind of way. It means that companies and people can work smarter. So all these clouds help you work smarter too, don't they, Dad? Yes. It means small companies can access IT services they couldn't normally afford, and so they can be more competitive. And when bigger companies like mine want to change the way we work, what used to take up to two months to do, we can now get up and running in a couple of days. But if it's in the cloud, won't all your stuff just blow away? What? Lose information, you mean? N no. Public clouds have to be secure if businesses are going to use them. And for sensitive information, we can have clouds inside our company. They're called private clouds for our really, really secret stuff. But uh, don't tell anyone. I won't, Dad. I won't even tell Daisy. Who? The cow on the computer, the one you said before. Oh. Daisy. Well, that's another story. Sometimes you're really silly, Dad.